decades to understand why things are happening the way they are, not just this is division. Today we are gonna use the stamp game to do the equation 856 divided by four. So now in division, we're gonna start with our largest place value to divide. And division is all about being fair. So each Skittle needs the exact same amount. So I'm gonna distribute evenly my hundreds. Well, it's completely tangible, right? So everything you can, they can see it and they can manipulate the pieces, right? So it's not abstract. The way I was brought up was you did this with a pencil and paper. Now each Skittle has 200, right? So I'm gonna to move to my tens place. It's much simpler for them to, to grasp that concept and they're understanding why it's dividing e equally or not equally. Each Skittle now has 10. I still have one more 10 to distribute. Mm, I can't do that. It's not fair. It's not fair. Okay, so I'm gonna take my 10 and I'm going to exchange it for 10 units. One, two. So I think um, Marlo was using the division bead board and the division test tube. So you can, there are so many, you can do all the operations on many different materials. You can do it on the um, bead frame here, the large bead frame, the small bead frame. And so we teach them how to do it on different ones and sometimes they just kind of really get attracted to one certain material, it clicks with them and they'll continue to use that material. And that's totally fine and that's, that's the idea of Montessori is following the child, allowing them to explore that material or whatever their interests are.